Hi everybody and welcome back to IBEX Running. I'm Coach Rachel and today we have a 40 minute endurance calorie shred workout. I hope you guys are ready. If you miss any speed or incline changes, don't worry. I want you to look over onto this side of your screen. We'll have all of that displayed over here for you to see. And then if you look over onto the other side of the screen, you're gonna see this really nice long progression bar. That's gonna show you where we are from start to finish through this whole entire workout. I hope you have a towel and a water bottle handy because we are gonna get sweaty today. So if you're ready to get sweaty, look down at that tread, find your start button. Let's get it going in three, in two, and one. We start off 2.5, 3.5, we're here for a minute. All right, we'll start warming up the body and then I'll give you the roadmap for this workout today, okay? So just start warming up, walk it out, walk it out. Nice inhale through the nose. <sighs> nice exhale, let it go. 40 minutes, all right? We're gonna start with some nice longer runs. I'm gonna be honest, so when I, I think I've said this before, was never really a runner my whole entire life, not until the pandemic happened. When I would run, this is exactly how I would run, okay? I would start with a longer time period. So we're going seven minutes, six minutes, five minutes, four minutes. As the time decreases, our speed increases, all right? And I'm being honest, this is how I actually trained my whole entire life. In order to get me to where I could actually sustain running for a longer period of time, this is what I would do. All right, we're going 4.5, 6.5, a warm-up jog for one minute in three, two, one. Nice, easy warm-up jog, okay? Don't go too crazy, not yet. We got another 39 minutes to go crazy. From here, we're just warming up. Good, shake out the arms. Roll the shoulders down and back. Inhaling and exhaling. <sighs> Landing soft on the balls of our feet, right? All right. Try not to look too far up. I always say it because I have that problem. When I start to get a little fatigued, I like tilt my chin up and it actually makes it harder for you to breathe. All right, we got one more minute of a warm up, and then we're going into our first interval. We have eight intervals. We start at seven minutes straight, one minute break. Six minutes straight, one minute break, all right? We follow that all the way down to one minute. Oh, I'm sorry, 30 seconds, even better. Take it down to a walk, 3.0, 4.0, and five. Four, three, two, let's walk it out. All right, you can go slow if you want. <sighs> Warm up the lungs. The first couple minutes in this first interval, that's all it's gonna be. If you haven't warmed up on your tread yet, you use this little warm up, maybe you're not there yet. First couple minutes, and the first interval, just warming up, right? 5080. Again, that's a big gap. So if you're on, you know, if you're a more experienced runner, 7 8, right? If you're a beginner runner, there's no shame in your game. Five, the point is to hold for seven minutes. Doesn't matter if it's at a 5.0. We hold for seven, okay? That's the goal. We'll do a one interval at a time. One goal at a time, and guess what? We're gonna crush it. So we got 15 seconds. I know, the long one, after we do like the first two or three, it's gonna go by super fast, okay? Seven minutes, in five. Five-o, oh, eight-o, oh, in three, in two, and one, pick it up, pick it up, let's go. Let's go. I am so excited to run. You guys have no idea. I'm coming off of a herniated disc. I haven't ran for a couple weeks now, and I've been dying, slowly dying on the inside. Oh, this is like a redemption run for me, like just to get the feet going, the blood flowing. So I'm not quitting. So you guys don't quit, all right? We're already 30 seconds down, six and a half minutes to go. Woo! Yeah, so I'm gonna run on the softer side. So I'm with my more beginner runners. You stay with me. My more advanced runners, you know what to do. Pick it up. You got 40 minutes. Push yourself. We didn't get on this treadmill, right? To take it easy. We came here to make miracles happen. Change your body one minute at a time. One stride at a time. That's one minute down, all right? Yes, I missed you guys. That's the problem. I can't stay away from you. All right, six minutes left. Let's go over the form, right? Shoulders, hips, knees, ankles, <laughs> you name it, body parts, you know? 
try to get everything a little bit more tucked underneath, right? Hips tucked underneath the shoulders. Good. Keep running here. <sighs> nice, soft. Landing again on the balls of our feet, not on our heels. Not due to on to our tippy toes. <sighs> and breathe. Good. Remember to hydrate when you need to howl off when you need. If you can wait till our break, try it, okay? But if you need to hop off, grab a sip of water, jump back in. Look, two minutes down already. Five minutes to go. Oh man, it's gonna go by super fast today. Who's ready for hour long runs? I'm just gonna, if you want one, 60 minute run, put it in the comments. I think I can make that happen. I know people, I know a few people around here. I'm ready for those. Okay, shaking out the arms. How you guys doing today? You're like, shut up, Rachel. I'm trying to run here. It's okay. I'm just trying to keep you guys entertained. All right, coming up four minutes. Four minutes left, not four minutes in. First one's the hardest, right? 5080. If it becomes a little easy and you want to push yourself, increase your speed by 0 0.1, 0 0.2. All right, four minutes left. My body's starting to feel nice and warm now. <sighs> Legs are starting to heat up. Feel it in my core. <sighs> Rolling the shoulders down and back. <sighs> Don't forget to smile, guys. We're having fun. <sighs> looking good, looking good, looking good. Keep running. <sighs> Squeeze the core nice and tight. Listen to the sound of your feet, right? Do they sound like the tempo is nice and even? Or sound a little off? Maybe one leg is striding a little bit further than the other. Keep going. All right, we're past the halfway mark on this first interval. So the hardest part is over. You got three minutes left. Then we get to walk for a minute. And now. I'm like, walking, what's walking? I don't wanna walk, I wanna keep running. You're gonna need it, okay? Let that minute, use it, recuperate, bring your body back to life, go harder, cause we're gonna speed it up on interval number two. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Two and a half minutes left. That's so now it's starting to settle and you're like, oh wait. I'm actually doing this. I'm actually running for seven minutes straight. I don't know if I can handle it. You can, you got it. We're already almost there. We got two minutes left. Okay. Would you keep your eyes on the prize? And then if you didn't and you want to, maybe set a goal. I say this when I teach yoga, a goal or an attention for the workout today. What is it? Is it, I want to make sure I run, finish every interval? That's a good goal, right? I don't quit until we actually take that recovery moment. I'm not quitting, I'm not acting, it's not running until, until I take that recovery moment. Set yourself up a little goal. Not a big one, a little one. One that you know you're gonna crush. And then set up another one. And then do it again. Whew. You got 90 seconds. Walk it out then. This is it right here. This is where the run doesn't become more physical, it becomes more mental. And I just want you to remember that when you feel like there's tough moments in your runs, is this physical or is this mental? I'm gonna say 90% of it are gonna be mental. And then ask yourself the questions like, why am I doing this to myself? Why am I creating the doubts? Why am I telling myself it's hard? Why am I trying to tell myself that I need to slow down or I need to stop? And then eliminate that thought process. Throw it away. We run in here. And guess what? You got 40 seconds left. Then we walk it out. 
three, zero, four, five. So it doesn't even have to be a fast walk. 30 seconds. Keep smiling. Keep running. Last 20. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm with you. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna overdo it, we're gonna go in 10. Well, take that walk in seven, six, five, four, three, two. Let's walk it out. Three, oh, four, five. You're only here for a minute. We go right back to it, all right? We already did seven minutes. So what's six now, right? We got this, the hard part's over. We're gonna just increase it by 0.2, okay? Hydrate if you need it. Towel off if you need. Inhale, let it go, you did it, okay? Next one's a little bit shorter, just a smidgen faster. Remember 0.2, that's in your head, your body's really not gonna feel the difference. Maybe a little bit, but not really, all right? Six minutes, woo! Yes, 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 yes. I know you love it, guys. Here we go. In 10, five, two, eight, two. Wherever you were, you're increasing it by two and you are holding for six minutes, all right? In three, and two, and one, let's go. Five, two, eight, two. Let's get it going. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Squeezing, working, pumping the arms. Good. So not wide on the elbows. Elbows come back. There we go. See, 30 seconds down. The first 30, first minute, they go by quick. We're almost, I would say we're almost there. Ha! I don't wanna say I'm lying, but we're not almost there. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Good. All else fails, tune me out, listen to the music. Sometimes we'll be jamming. All right, five minutes. That's it. We can run for five minutes. We do that all the time. You can do anything for five minutes. <laughs> I say they could do that in my yoga class. They say that, but it's only for 10 seconds to say, you could do anything for 10 seconds. 10 seconds, five minutes, a little bit of a difference. But you can do anything for five minutes if you want to. Okay? All right. Breathe. You're freaking yourself out if you're stressed right now. You can do this. Clear your head. Inhale. Exhale, let it go. Good. Keep going, keep going. You guys are doing great. Good, coming up. Finishing two minutes. Four more to go. Like I said, the first three feet are gonna feel longer. Once we get to like the four minute interval, it's gonna go by like that, the second half of the workout. Just these first few that are longer, they're just gonna feel long, cause they are. I mean, hey, I'm speaking true facts here now. Keep going guys, four minutes left. Don't let your mind drift off. Pull yourself back in. Where are your, where's your head going? Pull it back. Every 15 seconds, maybe our head drifts off, right? When we're on the treadmill, the one goal is us, right? You start this machine for you, you end the machine for you, nobody else. That is a rule that we can, I'm gonna hold you accountable for. This is your moment. This is your time. I'm not gonna let you fail. You got it. Last three minutes. The walking part always stays the same. 3045. So when I say recovery, somewhere between 3045. All right. 
Put that big smile on your face. Coming up. We're halfway there. Keep going, keep going. We're a little bit more, less than halfway there. We should. Am I bad at math? Yes. But it's counting. Just keep running. You got two minutes, 15 seconds. And you get to walk. Maybe it's a little too easy. By 1.2, let's go. Remember, it's 5.2 five, five, to 8.2. You can go wherever you want to go between those numbers. Almost there. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Don't forget to smile. I know. Running is fun. It gives you endorphins. It makes you happy. Right? How many of you have done these workouts and get off the tread and then the first 10, 15 minutes, you're like living your best life. You're like silly and happy. Yeah. That's like magic. It makes magic happen. Get ready. Coming up. Last minute of interval number two. Keep going, keep going. Here we go, 60 seconds. That's it. Then the hard ones are done. I'm gonna go into the medium ones. Then the easier ones. Easier for time. Not easier for speed. 45. Bam, bam, bam. Get ready to walk it out, recover. Three, zero. Four, five. But don't touch it early. We still got 30 seconds. Keep going. Almost there, almost there, almost there. And a little bit of water break. Hydrate. Here we go. Last. 10, 8, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 3, 0, 4, 5. One minute, walk it out. Oh, yeah. Now go to 5. All right? I'm going to hydrate. You see my, not one of my many tails. Multitasking, drinking water, and walking at the same time. All right. We go five, four, eight, four. Adding on point two. Let it go. Five minutes here. I know you want it. You're going to work for it. Enjoy the next 20 minutes, 20 minutes, ha, 20 seconds. Don't enjoy that, because that ain't gonna happen. Not today. All right. We take it a five minute jog. You ready? It's the last of the long ones, I promise. You got five, four, three, two, five, four, eight, four. Five minutes, team. Oh yeah. Kind of like you're in your zone now, where you're like, oh, I got it. I'm just jogging now. Your body's nice and warm. It's used to the motion of running. I love that feeling. Easier to get back into it. So enjoy what you're doing now. Smile at yourself. Be proud of yourself. I'm in 40 minutes to yourself. Listen, I'm a mom, single mom. 40 minutes to myself? Oh, I'm like, did I just hit the lottery? Did I just hit the jackpot? So you know, if you got this time that you made for you, do not waste it, all right? Work on what it is you want. You come first in your life. You are the main character of your story. How many stories are there? Millions, right? But you are the main character of yours. So get what you need, and the only way to do it is to put in the work, right? Whew. Whew. Speaking real facts today. Let's go, crew. Bam, 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 bam. Come on. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. 
All right, we're about a minute and a half in. 90 seconds. Three and a half to go. Get a little sweaty. Yes. Yes. Oh, I feel like myself again. You know, taking this off to recover from my back. Anybody ever have a back injury? You're a runner. I totally sympathize. This has not been fun. Every day, looking at the road, looking at the treadmills, they looking back at me, and we making sad faces at each other. Like, I want to be there. We're doing it now. Keep going. Three minutes. Yeah, and it's fine. Like, listen, today, I'm very open about this injury. Sorry, guys, if it's TMI, but I'm not running my fastest. My goal for myself is to try to like heal my body and finish my workout, right? I don't wanna put myself out. I don't wanna go super hard, hurt myself again to where I can't run for another month. Not fun, totally not, right? I'm learning, slow and steady, listen to your body, but then push yourself out of your comfort zone, you know? There's a little bit of a push there. We got two minutes left. Whew. Then you get to walk and recover. One minute. That's 3045. And then those runs are gonna get faster, but shorter. A little sweat in the mustache. Miss that feeling. Bump it up, bump it up, bump it up. There we go. The cardio is still here. The body's just like, what happened? What did you do to me? That's why my body sounds sorry, like a Muppet. All right. You guys, coming up on this last minute already. Five minutes is a lot faster than seven. I would say my math skills are kicking in again. One more minute. Today I'm funny, I don't know. If you guys think I'm funny or annoying. <laughs> hopefully, hopefully the first one. <sighs> Let's go. Keep going, keep going. We're on this last minute here. You get to walk and recover in 45 seconds. <sighs> We're already more than halfway through the workout. Uh-huh. 23 minutes into it. We only have 40. Last 30 seconds. We take it down. 3 0, 4 5. We walk it out. One minute. Hydrate, towel off, catch your breath. Ten. You got it, guys. Don't quit early. Seven, five, four, three, two, three, oh, four, five. One minute. Walk it out. Oh, yeah. Having fun. All right. You ready for interval four? Four minute interval. Five, six, eight, six. I was my water bottle open because I couldn't figure out how to open it. Under pressure. Anybody ever ran a marathon? The hardest part is drinking and running. Running part is easy. It's the drinking or eating talent. It's a talent. Be like, ever see those talent shows at school? Be like, bro, what is your talent? It's just running and eating. <laughs> Sign me up, I'm good for that one. 10 seconds, four minutes. Five, six, eight, six. We go right to it in five, four, three, two, one. Pump it up. Pump it up four minutes. Let's go. A little bit faster. Listen, we're slowly increasing it. Our body is getting used to going a little bit faster. A little bit faster. See? My body's already like, ah. Oh. oh, okay, we're doing it again. It doesn't know that I'm going faster. It just thinks that I'm moving. 
Good. Listen, that first 30 is done. There's only three and a half to go now. I'm digging this workout a lot. So originally, like I said, when I was teaching myself how to run, this is what I would do. Except I would mirror the amount that I ran with the amount that I walked, because I really couldn't run at all. So I would do like the first interval, seven minutes run, seven minutes walk. So it's always an option. You can always think of a little bit extra things to do, but stick with me. I won't steer you wrong. You want something a little bit longer, but not super as aggressive as running more, just to increase the recovery moment or that recovery, you can always kick up on an incline, but don't touch the handlebars, right? I'm just letting you know that there's always options. If this is too hard or this is too easy, you want to take it up a little bit. We kind of want to follow the workout. I'll help you, you know? I got you. Coming up, two minutes. Two minutes left. That's it. Keep running, keep running. Keep moving, keep moving. Oh yeah. We only have a three, a two, a one, and then a 30 after this. Those are the runs, right? They're not gonna get harder, just faster. Last two minutes. Good, put a smile on that face. You can do it. You got it. Woo! All right, there we go. My body's starting to feel nice and nice. Back is warmed up. It's like, girl, we made it. You did it. Keep going. I just want to say to all of you guys, keep going. Don't quit. Don't stop. We got last minute coming up. Then you walk and recover. Here we go, last minute. 60 seconds, then we walk. And three, two, one. 60 seconds here. What's it feel like? Where's your head? Where'd the mind go? Pull it back into yourself. Mind, body, put them back together. Shake out those arms. Recenter, refocus. Keep breathing. You only have 30. 30 is left. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Last 20. You walk. Three, zero, four, five. Recovery moment, number four, and 10, and eight, and five, four, three, two, walk it out. <sighs> that one minute goes pretty fast though, right? All right, three minutes. They're getting easier, shorter, more obtainable, but we're pushing still out of our comfort zone, but picking up our pace. Hydrate, towel off. Remember who you are. For three minutes, you're gonna run. You're gonna go and you're not gonna stop. You still have 30 seconds. Inhale, exhale, let it go, right? If this is the hardest workout you've ever done, congratulations, but we're not done yet and you're gonna still finish. You're gonna still work hard, you have more to give. If this, if you've done, you've been with IBX for IBX for a long time, you're still gonna go hard. <laughs> Welcome back. Here we go in three, two, let's go. Five, eight, six, eight, uh, five, eight, nine, eight, eight. I'm sorry. Pick it up. Come on, it's three minutes. Five, eight, eight, eight. It's three minutes here. <sighs> Good, because like when we finish one minute, we only have two minutes left. And then when we finish two minutes, we only have one minute left. It's a treadmill math for you. You guys know if you're an avid 
treadmill enthusiast. You start playing those games. You start cutting time in half, making up math equations, right? You're like, oh, I got 10 minutes, so there's 15 minutes, and then there's only four minutes left. And you're like, oh, because you know what you did? You broke up that big chunk of time that seemed like an obstacle into tiny obtainable goals. You did that for yourself so you could crush it one piece at a time. I love that thought process. Guess what? Two minutes left. Keep going, keep going. Two minutes. I'm a chatty Cathy today, I'm sorry. I just missed y'all. Two minutes, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. We're moving faster, right? Let it go. We're almost halfway there. Squeeze that core. I gotta really think about stabilizing my glutes to protect my lower back. So if you have lower back issues, not like a Titan, but just like a, an extra squeeze to hold you in like stabilized. All right, coming up. I know, what'd I say? You got two minutes and one minute left. So last minute, and five, and four, and three, two. One minute, 60 seconds. Then we walk it out. Three, zero, four, five. Oh yeah, we got three left. I gotta come quick, all right? 40 seconds. Come on team, I know. Settling in, but you got it. Maybe a little bit of fatigue is what I was talking about. But you got this. You got about eight minutes left of the workout. What? That's it. It's already almost over. No way. We walk it out in eight and six, five, four, three, two, three, oh, four, five. All right. Two minutes. Two minutes. Six, oh, nine, oh. Hydrate towel off. These are the magic moments now. What do you do in these moments to find who you are as a person? Perhaps, right? You're gonna go harder or are you gonna quit? I say this all the time, you get to leave, you get to choose. Who do you wanna be today? How do you wanna leave this workout? You wanna be mad because you gave up, you slowed down, you quit early? Nobody wants that. Or do you wanna give it everything you got and prove to yourself you can do anything you want? Everybody, oh, she do. How did I know? How did I know? I'm psychic. Oh, here we go. Two minutes. Six oh, nine oh, and five, four, three, two. Let's go. Two minutes. It's over before you know it. Over before you know it. Good, keep pumping. 20 down, 140 to go. Now the right math for you guys. Real math. 30 seconds, 90 seconds left. Eye in the prize, look forward. <clears throat> Big inhale, we'll be serious now, okay? We're going hard. Last six minutes coming up. All right, we have one minute left in this run. Two more intervals after this. Keep it here, 60 more seconds. Let's go. There we go, keep breathing. Last 45. Whew. 
Here we go, coming up. Last 30. You got it. Keep going. Don't step, don't look down. Don't look at that tread. You just keep moving. Twenty seconds left. Come on, come on. What are you fighting for today? What are you thinking about? Where are you going? We got ten. We got nine. Eight. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Three. Oh, four. Five. You have two left. One is a minute, and one is thirty seconds. Six. Two. Nine. Two. It's one minute, all right? These ones, lightning speed, like who are you, the flash, all right? Here in the eyelash, that makes you look a little crazy in the face. Been there, done that, ladies, you know, our gentlemen with long hair. You ready? I know you said yes. I know like at home you're like, yes, I'm ready. Give me a minute. Don't be so excited. All right, one minute. Six, two, nine, two. And eight, seven, five, four, six, two, nine, two, let's go. One minute here. No pain, no gain, right? Keep working. Squeezing those cores. Pumping the arms. Put that smile on that face. We're doing a team. We have only 30 seconds left. Let's go. Come on. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. 20. That's it, that's it, that's it. Remember when we were running for seven? We're like, there's only six minutes left. You only have 10 seconds now. We go back down. Three, oh, four, five, and three, two, one. You're like, wait, what? A minute is done already? 30 second interval, six, four, 10, zero. Six, four, ten, zero. Oh yeah. Six, four, ten, zero. I said ten. But if your shrub can go faster than that, I mean, why not? Right? So only 30 seconds. By the time the treadmill even picks up speed, we're gonna be done with the sprint. 30 seconds, piece of cake. We go in 20. This one's for you, right? Mm-hmm. In 10, envision who you want to be. What does that perfect version of yourself look like? You run right to it. Tag it and then you're it, you know? Here we go in three, two, one, six, four, ten, zero. 30 seconds. Come on, pump it, pump it, work it, pop it, twist it. Kidding. Let's go. 20 seconds. Guess what? We're halfway there. 15 seconds left. Whew. 10, 8, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 3, oh, 5, 4. Walk it out. You got about two minutes right here. We covered. First minute, same recovery moment. I'm going to a cool down. How'd that feel? You good? I mean, I feel amazing. I don't know about you guys, but uh, I love it. Yeah, I love running so much. You know, it's very simple because it's not like a thing that costs money or anything. It's just something simple you can do for yourself that just makes you feel so incredible after. I think mean, that's why I love running so much. Because it's also like, mentally strong you know you have to force yourself not to quit right and you, the only way to do that is like to really have that inner dialogue with yourself that you can do it 
we take it down. Two, five, three, five, and three, two, one. Just slow it down. Last, last minute here. Cool down. Nice big inhale. Exhale. Again, inhale through your nose. Exhale, let it go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Feeling nice. 30 seconds. You want to slow it down a little bit more. Remember, we want to cool down our body. You don't want the heart rate to be high and then jump off, and you're like, you're still, you're still ants, you're still up. Cool the heart rate down, cool the legs down. Focus on your breath. Get some nice, good, deep, full inhales. Fill up that lower abdominal area. <sighs> Exhale, let it go. Remember to stretch, remember to hydrate also, okay? While you're home at night, I don't know what time you're running, but if, if it's the end of the day, do it after this. If, it's, if you do this in the beginning of the day, at night, while you're watching TV, relaxing, sit on the floor, stretch out a little bit, all right? Ain't gonna cost you nothing either. Here we go. Hit that stop button in three, in two, and one. My name is Coach Rachel. This is IBX running, and this is your endurance cardio shred. I'll see you guys next time.